you have no idea. I haven't done this like in years. And it's crazy. What I realized is crazy that how people forget, they forget how to, you know, you, you can call it be young, but the truth is we just forget how to have fun. And what's the last thing that you've done? What's the last thing that you've done that you know? If you write it on a piece of paper, something that makes you just fucking like smile because you enjoy it so much. Like riding a bike. See, we kind of, we lose touch. We lose touch with what really truly makes us happy because of what the, the rules become when we, once, we, once we get older, the rules of who we need to be, who we need to take care of, um, you know, how stuff is rigid, right? I mean, even as, as kids, once you get like, hey, you can be whoever you wanna be when you grow up. But once you get to college, you gotta fucking start getting serious, right? Because whatever you wanted to be in high school now, it's not serious anymore. It's not, it's not reality anymore, right? Because you gotta do the work, you gotta, you gotta hustle and you gotta struggle. And then once you hustle and struggle, you get to this happy place. Well, let me fucking tell you something. There's no happy ending from an unhappy journey. And to find that person inside again that can enjoy things, like be present with them, things that don't fucking cost anything. Like your presence with the people you love, doing the things that you love, it doesn't cost you fucking any money. But the thing is, what it costs you not to do is it costs you your soul, and it costs you your heart. So brother, I ask you, When's the last time you had fun? When's the last time you smiled when it wasn't forced? Where's the last time that you lived and you forgot about the day because you were so into it? You were so into your business. You were so into your clients. You were so into, most importantly, your family that you lost yourself and you didn't think about work and the shit that you had to do and the worries of the past and the, the shame and blame of the past and the fucking worries of the future of what could happen, what should happen, what may not happen, that really never does those thoughts that kill you. You see, like I went through this same process, right, where getting the things, the material things, the image, the statuses, that was it. That's what, that was gonna be my ticket, and the ticket to feeling the way that I wanna feel. And then I got the $100,000 car and the nice things and the travel and the material things. And yet this is what fucking makes me happier than all of it. Something that I haven't done for like 10 years.